we join Lara in the geothermal valley, a massive exploration space that is three times larger than any we've made before. You can spend hours here collecting and hunting resources, completing challenges, and discovering tombs. Rewards you earn help improve her gear and abilities. At base camp, Lara can upgrade her weapons, craft ammunition, and master new skills. You can customize Lara based on your preferences and play style. The valley below is guarded by Trinity forces, and you must decide how to defeat them. Just the ones they think might know something about the Atlas. Constantine's been asking a few questions. They've got the rest back up near the cathedral. Once we finish scrubbing this site, you men can head on up to the rest of them. So what are we looking for exactly? Command thinks the Atlas <laughs> need to be deep. We're looking for something. anything that might confirm. Take a look. Like what exactly? If we knew... What was I saying? All oh, right. If we knew, you wouldn't be looking. Documents, maps, anything that might confirm the intel. <laughs> in for us both. Then there'll be an initiation ceremony of some sort. So that's it? 
but some of those guys were on contract for years before training came around. Definitely patient. Combat encourages, encourages experimentation and choice, combining stealth with explosive action. In Rise of the Tomb Raider, no one will experience the game in quite the same way. But that's not all. Before I leave, I wanted to share a sneak peek of the incredible tombs that you can discover when the game launches on November 13th, and tease of the demo we're showing this week at the show. Thanks again, and have a great Gamescom.